Hi, I just want to show you guys how to mix the manicure and the glass ampules. I'm wearing glove on one hand just because I can possibly cut my hand with the glass when I break it. So make sure your hands are clean. And then you would need a filtered syringe. It will say that in the packet. Um, alcohol pads. So I'm going to go ahead and clean this part. So you're going to have the glass ampules that have the um, solution. And then you, you're going to have the powder. And then a 3 ml or 3 cc syringe. Um, I'm using 25 gauge to inject. Um, some people do 30 gauge, but I like 25 gauge better. I felt like when you're pushing the meds, it doesn't burn as much compared to when you're using um, the 30 gauge, but that's just me. So let's go ahead and get started. Here's that. Oh, supposed to be easy. All right. Go to the other one, just like that. That's very sharp. That's why I'm wearing gloves with this hand. You can wear gloves in both hands if you're more com comfortable doing that. And it's already open, so you don't have to put air in it. So you wanna use a filtered syringe so you don't get any broken glass in the solution. And you don't want to risk injecting the broken glass into your skin. There's that. And just go ahead and put it in this bottle. Oops. And as you can see, as soon as you put the as soon as you put the solution, the powder over, dissolves like right away. And we're just going to do the same exact thing with the next one. And don't do not shake it. It will it will get dissolved like very quick. If you want, you can roll it just like that. And then what I want to do is put a little bit of air in there. Put it upside down, get the meds. So my dose is 150 IU. So you can't really use insulin syringe because insulin goes only up to 100. hundred and fifty IU and mLs are going to be exactly two mLs. So 150 IU is going to be two ml or two cc. trying to get every single bit every single drop of it they said you don't really have to get all of it but you know i'm trying to make sure i'm getting all my dose and there's that okay and once you're done just recap the needle twist it, take it off, and then use your 25 gauge to inject. So you can see here, that is two mLs. All right, I'm gonna show you guys how to inject it on my next video. Thank you.